Sir, so Probin has recently completed 12 years of operations in India. Yeah. So share us about your journey. We started our journey way back in 2012 and that was a very turbulent time with the yen being all time high in the currency conversion. So it has been a roller coaster ride, uh, but uh, it's a good journey so far. We started with a very small team of 12 people mm -hmm. and today we are a strong team of 56. So that says the growth story. And from a very small turnover in the first year, today we are almost on the verge of touching 100 crores. So that's also a very good journey. That's uh, good, sir. Yeah. So <clears throat> most importantly is the uh, the journey. Uh, we have installed a lot of uh, brand new machines in India and changed the concept of new machines viability. That is very important. Uh, of course, three years of COVID were really troublesome, challenging. We had our own uh, set of problems for manpowers, but we came over above uh, with that. And uh, recent uh, developments in the field of digital presses, we have done pretty good and uh, installed uh, pretty uh, heavy configurations in the market which will be good. So overall journey has been pretty good. Okay, sir. Yeah. So sir, how many installations have you done up till now? Uh, we have done uh, for RNGT process close to 105, brand new, and uh, since 2014, mm -hmm. when the joint venture between RNGT and uh, Ryobi and Mitsubishi took place. And uh, one, two, three, four, five of, uh, four of uh, Miyakoshi presses and now digital. So roughly around 110 presses. Okay, sir. Uh, brand new presses. So you recently also installed two Miyakoshi presses, one in Delhi NCR and one in Mumbai. Yeah. So tell us about those installations. Yeah, they have been pretty uh, prestigious installations because they are in inkjet digital segment. Mm -hmm. You know, this segment is growing very fast in India and developing its own market. And uh, the machines which we have installed are very high configuration mm -hmm. and uh, uh, inkjet presses with high speed and high reservation. So one machine has been uh, installed uh, with the cutting and count stacking facility for book publication industry. And the other machine is for the variable data printing. Mm -hmm. So two different industries, two different applications, but one same one machine, like same machine has been given to both the people. Uh, this has been pretty good. Uh, both the machines have been installed and in, uh, are under uh, are now running uh, at both uh, Mumbai and Delhi. So that's it. It's an interesting journey in inkjet digital segment. So, sir, would you like to talk about some of your major milestones in the past 12 years? So we started with the Mitsubishi Heavy Industries yeah. in 2012. And uh, subsequently with the uh, formation of RMGT, which is a joint venture of YOB and MHI industry, uh, MHI. Uh, RMGD was formed and uh, since then we have not looked back. That's a major milestone in our journey. And in last 10 years of this operation, 100, 105 presses new installed in India, up and running, growth is happening. That is the major milestone. Subsequently in 2017, uh, we signed up with uh, Mia Koshi and uh, this also took some time because of uh, by the time the market was established and uh, COVID came and then we had to wait again. So that was one and then uh, uh, that's and the next major milestone now is the digital segment. Uh, they have a real, uh, this, is, this is going to be a real game changer in time to come. So these are the major milestones and our focus basically right from beginning is to supply 
the equipments which are in high end category like mm. it is not that uh, by name of uh, just giving a equipment which is high quality it should serve the purpose and improve the productivity of the customer viability of the printer so we are focused right from beginning on these points and uh, continuing to that we have signed up with few more companies uh, which will be uh, catering to printing industry in uh, future uh, near near future market so so you, you have recently signed with smith also yes so tell us about that collaboration uh, as i just now said we uh, we have a focus of uh, giving uh, the high quality products for the printing industry for enhancement of productivity and profitability so interaction with smith is in a similar direction now smith along with all the other companies worldwide are looking at india market in a big way india market is growing and everybody is eyeing the market and smith wanted to have a interaction and uh, collaboration with a company in india which can provide services as per their uh, standards so our name was recommended by one of our customer to smith and then uh, we signed up so now we will be supplying the smith products in india so smith is basically into binding equipment yes so tell us about that if you look at the buy book uh, segment uh, smith has invented the book swing machine and they hold a patent for that mm -hmm. so basically they started uh, the swing machine thing and they are one of the leader uh, in the industry the product is very highly uh, technically uh, proven product mm -hmm. and they have a very nice concept of uh, servicing the customers so it is not like that they will just leave the customer each smith machine comes with a free online support for the life of the equipment okay. and that's a very very big thing you know there are machines running of uh, 70s 80 uh, early 70s and they are supporting so wherever online support can be given they are giving the support for the equipment smith has uh, uh, some type with the two companies one is uh, canon and the one more company for digital equipments mm -hmm. now they are giving the equipments uh, suitable for digital uh, segment also along with the book publishing the major offset industry so the products will be available in india for both the segment digital as well as uh, offset so so you also recently collaborated with shanghai spant intelligent equipment yes so tell us about that yeah the the real collaboration uh, or, or the interesting uh, collaboration now uh, is with uh, spande it's a very interesting company very technologically solid company and uh, they are into manufacturing of high end flexo presses and digital presses so we are now going to launch these equipments in india and we are sure then we will disrupt the indian market with these products they are very good quality product developed by uh, a chinese person but these are sophisticatedly um, very productive equipments so we should be able to do and as we do for all products we so sell uh, the equipment only those equipments which we do the service we provide service so continuing the tradition we will be doing for both smith as well as for uh, spand okay sir so would you like to talk about the commercial printing industry in india yeah commercial printing industry right now uh, uh you if you can divide it into two book publication is a separate segment commercial as of now is not uh, growing 
Of course, the slide that happened uh, during COVID time, so it has gone down. So it's not going down further. But I don't see any uh, major, uh, you know, improvement happening in the segment because more and more online thing and short short run uh, things will be coming up. So digital, uh, you know, a digital segment will. Uh, <clears throat> the not the digital print segment, it will be the digital media which will be taking over the more, more of the commercial activities. Book publication, yes, it is booming and it is likely to continue for next two to three years. So sir, tell us about your joint venture with Katsura Roller India. Yeah, see we have been uh, uh, supplying printing machines, we have been in printing industry and we have seen the pain point of the uh, printers uh, towards the uh, quality of rollers which are available in India. And now with more and more new machines coming in India, it becomes very important uh, uh, for the users to have good quality rollers for uh, achieving good printing. Yes. So for this reason, we have gone in for a joint venture with a Japanese company called Katsura Roller Company, which is a 125 years old company, manufacturing the equipment, uh, the rollers for, for almost uh, all the machines in Japan. And they are the OEM supply for RMGT. Earlier they were OEM for uh, Kamori also. Well, that's a pretty good company into printing rollers and industrial application. And for that purpose, we have gone in for a joint venture and we are establishing a manufacturing facility in India, in Faridabad. And from there, we will be uh, supplying the Japanese quality rollers at an affordable price. Okay, that is the main thing, that the good quality rollers at an affordable price. They will not be cheap, of course, but they will be at affordable price. So, so would you like to talk about your entry into the Flexo printing market? Yeah, we just uh, have made an entry into Flexo printing market with uh, Spande equipment. See, earlier we were into label uh, segment, but we had Mia Koshi offset rate. So offset we had uh, intermittent and rotary uh, offset presses, but we didn't add up flexo press. So now with Spande, we are going to enter into the flexo printing market and we should be able to do pretty well. So what are your expectations from this market? Uh, we hope that we will be able to uh, give, give, have to give a good run to all the leading machine suppliers. I, I think we will be in a better position to answer this question a year or a half later. You see, Indian printing industry is evolving. We are moving into new machines, new technology, but we have to spend time to understand what is good for us. What is good for Europe market, USA market may not be good for our market or there may be something which is good also. So we have to make our own evaluation and that is very important for Indian printing industry. Uh, we are a very big industry and we as an industry we have survived the jolt of COVID. Mm -hmm. So that is really commendable. So uh, we were expecting that a lot of you know companies will fall, but that has not happened. Yes, that shows the inherent strength of our uh, economy and uh, the companies in the segment. Mm -hmm. But we have to still strengthen this further, mm -hmm. and we are trying our best to give the products which will offer. Uh, productivity enhancement and uh, profitability enhancement for the printers in the time to come and focus on these services. Yes, there was an interruption in between. Everybody had this and suddenly after that there was a big boom, big requirement. So things are catching up, we are catching up. 
and we are trying to do our best and we'll continue to do our best for the customers. So all the best for that. Thank you. Thank you so much.